So, Gwen, are you listening? Well, in my professional opinion, as a witch, I think you should. I know I have to do evil to get Indora back, but, but this situation with, with Gwen and Ethan and their son and, and, and Ethan, Teresa's son, as, as, as a possible donor match is, is hellish enough already. <sighs> Gwen's in the worst possible position a woman could be in. Having to choose between her baby and the man she loves. <laughs> She's going to suffer whatever she does. I, uh, I hope I don't regret this. <sighs> like the time I helped Gutenberg build that little printing press. I've made up my mind. When? I'm going to let you off the hook this time. I'm going to stay out of the mess you're in, at least for now. But let me tell you, as awful as things are for you right now, things are only going to get worse. You are going to be driven to the brink of utter despair. If you think you've suffered, for years, in the push-pull between you and, and, and Ethan and Teresa, oh, you think you suffered losing Sarah? But <laughs> that, there's nothing you've, you've ever been through to compare with the agony 